So something very interesting is going on with the latest iPhones. With the iPhone 14 Pros and the iPhone 14 Pro Maxes, a lot of people are actually going through and selling their specific iPhones. And in fact, a lot of these iPhones are selling for retail price, if not even higher than retail price, which is actually very insane. And I'm asking myself, why are people selling these iPhones? You know, they're brand new iPhones. Why are people selling them? Now, for one, every single year, people buy new iPhones and they usually sell them. Sometimes they get them as gifts. You know, we typically see it all every year. It's really not that big of a deal. However, at the quantity that these iPhones are being sold and for the a little bit of, you know, extra ink, like the pricing where these iPhones are still being and retaining that specific brand new price tag is very, very insane. And the reason for this, like, for example, I'm looking at a ton of different iPhone 14 Pros. Some, you know, are selling for $1,199 for the 512 gigabyte model. Some are selling for $990 with, you know, $11 shipping, so about $1,000 for that 256 gigabyte model. So there's a lot of different iPhones here that are actually being sold at very decent prices. Here's a brand new iPhone 14 Pro selling for $1,079, which is $79 more than what it is in the brand new market. So why would somebody purchase one that's more expensive in the used market than go ahead and buy it in the you know brand new market? And the reason for this is delays. The reason why you know people are selling their iPhone 14 Pros could be many reasons. They get them as gifts. They go ahead and got one from work or whatever the case is. They had an extra one or they will retail. The return policy went away. They have to resell it. There are tons of reasons why people are doing that. But a big thing Apple said recently is that the delays, there's so many delays in shipping where you can receive these iPhones. In fact, yesterday I went ahead and just plugged in the base model iPhone, the cheapest iPhone I could find, and from the 14 Pros. I tried every other color variant and all the delay, all the shipping dates were telling me that it was supposed to be coming to me from December, I think 19th to December 23rd. So that is a massive time frame that's crazy away. I mean, that's over a month away from, you know, when I actually put in the dates. So these iPhones are seeing massive delays. Because of that, a lot of people want to go ahead and get one before holidays, get one before certain things. And because of that, a lot of people are probably end up going to have to go to use market and they have to go and pay a premium. I'm looking at some more iPhone 14 Pros here. 128 gigabyte model, 1175. The 14 Pro Max, 128 gigabyte model, 1499. Another 14 Pro Max that was used, 1100. So there are so many other iPhone 14 Pros here and it's crazy how much these are being sold for. Typically every year, these things would already be like around 900 to 850 dollars on average, but I'm seeing a lot of these things from 950 to about 11 hundred dollars just for the 14 pros so it's actually pretty insane what's going on i don't know if apple should have put out that release statement but i do understand why they did it but it's kind of increasing the use prices of these iphone 14 pros so i would love to hear your thoughts about this let me know in the comment section below hit the like button that would be so much but definitely hit that subscribe button more importantly than everything else i love every single one of you guys hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out till then